Hello everybody, Shadow here, and welcome back to I the Somnium Files. Last time we talked with Mizuki and her teacher, Hitomi, and now we have to go to the hospital and marble. Let's go to the hospital and see if Renju is awake. Maybe. You okay? Oh. Why am I here? Okay. There's no one here. Indeed. Right? The bed is empty. Indeed. Bedside table. Headlight fable. That's not even a thing. It really isn't. But can we make it a thing? Let's make it a thing. I don't know why. Let's just make it a Dante, thing. Dante, look! Sabako is coming out of the TV! Who? That reference was... That, that reference flew over my head. Oh, hi! <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> I didn't even notice. <laughs> Okay, you started off screen, so to be fair. <laughs> and I'm a you nurse. are I work here. I'm assigned to Mr. Okiera. Right. Where is he? He's not here, as you can see. Yes. Didn't even notice you because I was so distracted by the fact that he wasn't here. Mr. Okiera's room. I'm right. certain of it. Okay. Where is he? He snuck out at night. Uh, snuck out? Snuck out? Mr. Okiura arrived with internal injuries. The surgery was successful, but he was in no condition to move. Right. He would have opened up his wounds, and then he would be in real trouble. Okay. Real trouble, huh? Yes. I can't believe it. Where could he have gone? Okay. Renju is extremely suspicious. Oh, definitely. He has no alibi for the time of Shoko's murder. Right. That was noted in the investigation report. That's not no. so strange, though. There's more. I cannot reach Renju by any means. Right. He has not attempted to visit Mizuki in the hospital. Indeed. Even though she is his daughter and witnessed a traumatic event. Despite all this, he runs from the hospital, even with substantial injuries. Oh, yeah. Perhaps this is an escape. Most likely. However, uh, <laughs> at first I, I was thinking he might not die, but Roger that. He, he probably will die now because he's disappeared. Hello, this is Lemnus Gate Entertainment Offices. Let me hear your message. Thank you. Okay. Do you have any idea where he might be? Uh, sorry, no clue. I'm trying to get in touch with him too. So far, nothing. I'm right. so worried. He must yeah. be a mess right now. Oh, wait. Maybe he's at the maid cafe. Okay. Maid cafe. Do you so mean that's where we get, pocket? That's where we get the yeah, hint. That's the one. Like out of nowhere, Renji was like, "I'm going to rent out Sunfish Pocket." I guess he was going to throw like a secret party or something. By okay. Accident and all. Still, yeah. He might be there. Okay. Well then. Thank you. I guess we have a place helpful. to check out. No problem. Farewell. Sunfish pocket, huh? Yep. It is worth scoping out. And we're gonna find him dead again. <laughs> However, I'm gonna go to Marble first, on the off chance that we do find him dead. Actually, I think it's a little bit too early to find him dead. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. Hmm. Who knows? I don't. Well, well, Hello. if it isn't Dante. Long time no see. Is something wrong? Well, I can no, for information. I just wanted to talk. About Shoko Nadami, Ren's ex? Yes. You're as sharp as ever. 
I saw it all on the news. How awful. How have you been? I've been okay. Nice. How are you, Date, honey? I don't see you around here much anymore. I've been busy. You used to come all the time. You and Ren, grumbling over your glasses of bourbon. All right. Laughing, drowning each other's sorrows. Sometimes getting into arguments. Right. One time it even became a real fight. You remember that? Oh, that I want to see. Really? Oh, yes. <laughs> you don't remember? It must have been something if that your side was response. Spilled your beer on Ren's watch. Ren was furious, oh, okay. yelling about how this I forgot about, more I completely forgot about life, the watch. Whatever. He blew up on you. Completely forgot about that. That was the only time I've ever seen Ren that mad. That's why I remember it so well. All right. What about yeah, his watch? His favorite watch. He got it from his new lover. An anniversary gift. Okay. Oh, this was, of course, after the divorce. <laughs> right. Ren was so happy. He showed it off to me. He's had that watch on him ever since. I see. Um, can you get me a glass of water? Hmm, that's unusual. Not a bourbon. It's in the middle of the day. I drink at work all the time. We have very different occupations. It's kind Indeed. of the same. I make people throw up. You make people throw up the truth. Uh, I mean... Fair, but... I feel like there's a... Bit of I have bigger difference than just the wording. I don't know how useful it will be. No, tell me. You know how Shoko was a representative of that investment company? Yeah. Right. They were part of a massive fraud scheme. Da da. Really? That's right. We already knew that, but. And they were in bed with the Kumakuras, the Yakuza gang. So maybe the Kumakuras killed her. I don't know for sure, but they were capable of it. Right. Maybe Shogo did something to piss off the wrong people. Are we going to get thrown back into the... <laughs> We're going to go visit their office again and kick their butts again? I say again. It's been a while. That's on the other timeline, no so... What's wrong with Ren? Well, yeah. He got in a car accident, and then now he's disappeared. Oh, no, really? Yeah. Yep. I see. I'll contact you if I get anything. Please right. do. Okay. Well, I guess we are not going to kick butt. Mama, my goodness. You've changed since I last saw you. You're such a square now. Excuse me, that is a fridge. Okay, that was rude. <laughs> okay, so we're just getting some more information. We're getting basically the information that we got explaining to Mizuki last time. But she's not here, so. Shoko was involved in illegal activities. Right? Perhaps the rental phone was used for that purpose. Quite possible. The Kumakuras. They have a relationship with Renju. Yup. I remember him telling me that. Do you want to pay them a visit? Yeah. I hope it won't cause problems. Oh, it definitely will. Okay. Well, let's go do that. <laughs> Is it just going to be the scene from before, or is it going to be different? I don't know, actually. Huh. Who's this asshole? Hi. You made a big mistake coming here. Go home. All right. Bye, then. Hey, Date. What? Ugh, I hate dealing with these chumps. Didn't you hear me? Do you want to die, old man? Yeah, this is looking like it's the, pretty much the same as before. 
Yeah. Yeah, this is this is pretty much the same, it looks like. I mean, things are going to be a little bit different, because, like... Sorry for the late introduction. I'm with the Certain MPD. events have changed. Cup, huh? But, yeah. Yeah. This feels very familiar. So, you want to explain what the fuck a cop is doing in my office? So I think we should exchange names before exchanging ex. Names MoMA. All right, yeah. MoMA. Two days ago at Bloom Park, a woman. Have you heard the name Shoko? Nid sure. How? Heard it on the news. The media is making a real fuck. Can't help but it. Yeah. If I make a wish, will it come true? That is not Shenron. I wish for panties. I told you that's not Shenron. All right. The Kumakura Crest. Right. Hi. I think most of this is the same. <laughs> what? The so, chairman is. Yeah. What? I run. That can't be the chairman of the Kumakura. Yeah, this is all mostly the same. You aren't the chairman. Yo. Eh. Date, wait, I did some he left to his death. But MoMA did not MoMA took over six. I do kind of wish that it recognized, hey, you've been on the other route and you can just fast forward most of this. Don't I know where but I can't, so I have no idea what You must have got Right. Fuck no. Why would we do that? Date. Look, the thermograph from when you inquired about Shoko. Okay. Body temperature rising. Red hot lie. It appears okay. that way. Huh. How do I get him to come to it? Remove his fingernails one by one. Um, no, I don't think that's Not legal for a police officer to do. Blackmail him? Blackmail? Find okay. his weakness and threaten him with it. Let's examine the room. Okay, Perhaps so now it's different. Okay. Hmm. Do you think that pulls out into a bed? What would be the point of that? Not much. In a place like this. Definitely an interesting motto. All right. Well, lanterns. Shrine. The desk. I hear. Can you hack it? I cannot. The power is off. Darn. Um. Let's see. Phone. Oh. There we go. Anything else? I got nothing to say to you. Fair. Sorry. Won't bother you. Um, anything else? Big flying squirrel. Um, no, I think that it's a tiger. A tiger. Okay. Let's see. What else have I not clicked on? I don't know. There 
would be no point in talking to him in that state. Right? I'm just trying everything. I'm blind, aren't I? Oh, oh, oh. There's a hidden safe behind the crest. Oh, okay. I recognize that. It's just like the one I saw at Matsushita Diner. An ace of Correct. But why is that there? Because oh, he's no. a fan. But perhaps. Hey, you wouldn't happen to be a fan of Aesop, would you? What? Who's that? A schoolgirl internet idol. You know what I'm talking about. Think you can get away with talking to our boss like that? Oh, yes. Tough as bricks and hard as nails. Never and... be a pussy shit like that, you fucker. Oh, I... do I have to throw somebody into the river? Because I will throw you into the river. I got very good at it in Yakuza Kiwami too. Fears. Fears. Upset. Uh, regret. Aset. Wow. <laughs> really? Shadows. Threat. A uh, silhouette. Aset. Man. What? You. Wet. Uh, sweat. Aset. Aset. You bet. That's just pathetic. as I thought. Boss. You broke What's that this? easily. Wow. Sh shut up. Don't look at me. Get out of here. Did you hear me? I said get the fuck out of here! Yes, yes, sir. Well, this is a turn of events. I've got your secret now. If you don't want that to get out, you better answer my questions. Yeah, we yeah, got him. I got it. <laughs> Do you have an alibi? Us Kumakuras are a branch of the Ujisaki family. The Ujisaki right. family runs a yearly golf tournament. Mandatory attendance. Okay. We were all at the tournament those days. We only got back this morning. You've been asked a hotel. They'll tell you. Dante, right. I did some research. The hotel's record of guests does list the Kumakura members. They were also seen on several surveillance cameras. It is not possible that any of the Kumakuras could have killed Shoko. Convenient. Including Moma. We already knew that, but, um... What about Rohan? Rohan was my older brother. He was my big brother in this organization, and my blood brother. But he's gone now. A suicide. Right? Yeah. After breaking out of the hospital. Was he hospitalized in the other About one? About 20 years back. Both he and I were the new guys in the Ujisaki family. The Ujisakis are above the Kumakuras in the hierarchy. Right. At the time, we were in a turf war with a rival gang. One day, one of their boys walks in here and beats my bro's face in with a metal bat. Okay. His vision's been fucked on the right side ever since. The doctors say he can still see. But it doesn't register. Like, he oh. only eats food off the left side of his plate. And if he's drawing a picture or whatever, he only draws the left side. Huh. Date, a question for Moma. Is Rohan left handed? Why? Just ask him, please. Okay. Yeah, he was. Confirmed. Rohan must suffer from hemispatial neglect on his right side. As you are right. aware, the brain is divided into what is called the right brain and left brain. Indeed. One side develops into the superior hemisphere, responsible for language and higher functions. The other side controls spatial recognition ability. Okay. In most people, the superior hemisphere is the left brain. Okay. In only one third of the population, the right brain is the superior hemisphere. This is often linked to left-handedness. I see. Moma just confirmed that Rohan was left-handed. Right. From this, 
we can conclude that his right brain was his superior hemisphere, and his left brain was the inferior hemisphere. I see. Rohan suffered a beating on the left side of his head. That must have damaged his left brain. That caused him to lose his spatial cognitive ability. I see. Funnily enough, anyway, I am also left-handed. shit beaten out of him, he changed, man. He became cold-blooded. I'm talking ruthless. Okay. One time, we captured some street bosses from a rival gang. Bro grabbed him by the big toe and took a potato peeler to him. From the toe Ooh. to the thigh. Totally blank expression. Like he was scraping bonito flakes. Oh boy. Anyway, sick fuckers like that always end up running the world, don't they? He started climbing the ranks, and eventually he was taken in by the Ujisaki family boss. Okay. The Ujisakis decided to make him head of our gang. That's how we became the Kumakuras. Nice. About six years ago, I remember him telling me about something big. Some threat to the Kumakuras that could bring us all down. Okay. He didn't give me the details, but I figured it was something from his past coming back to bite him in the ass, you know? Okay. Anyway, his plan was to handle his shit internally. Didn't want too many people knowing about it. Whatever he planned didn't work. When the chips were down, he decided to handle it himself. Right. He ended up shooting some guy in his house. Okay. A few days later, cops busted him. Prosecution tried to get him on premeditated murder, but it was determined that he was insane at the time. I Maybe see. Maybe they were right, you know. His head's been getting worse and worse for the past 20 years. It's relapses and all that. Okay. Anyway, they decided to keep him in a special hospital. And naturally, because I'm his brother and next in line, I was the successor. Okay. About Shoko. Right. We do have connections with the investment company Shoko worked at. The company that commits fraud. No comment. Anyway, we never had any problems with Shoko. There'd be no reason for us to kill her. Okay. So, uh... I had no idea you were a fan of a... Met Idol. How did you know? You're hiding an A-set figure in the safe. How did you know that? I have superpowers. Yeah, sure. I mean, he kind of does. <laughs> No point it's hiding it, right? High tech superpowers. Yeah, I know about Shoko's ex. Do you know where he is? Nope, sure don't. It's not like we keep in touch or anything. I detect okay. no abnormalities in his thermograph. Right. Looks like he's not lying. Okay. Hey, Moma, I've got a favor to ask. Can you get me information on Renju? His whereabouts, rumors on where he might be, anything. I need some leads. And what if I refuse? And your gang finds out you're the world's biggest ASAP fan. Ta da! In exchange for helping me, there's a reward in it for you. A reward? I'll let you meet ASAP. What? <laughs> I met her yesterday at Lemniscape. We're acquaintances now. Really? Yup. Yeah. You promise? Yeah, I promise. Okay, well. The Kumakuras appear to be unrelated to I think we have a better relationship with this guy still than the other timeline. So that's good. Really? That information might come in handy later. Let's go so, uh, so is actually not here this time. That's interesting. So, yeah. All right, time to see if time to see if he's dead. Okay. Oh no, we're much too early. That happens tonight, right? Welcome home, Sea King. Sea King. 
Oh! <laughs> Is this your first time here? Uh, sorry. I'm not here as a customer. I need to talk to someone about something. Oh, hey! It's Ota! Jeez, kid. Excuse me. Oh, sir! Oh, wait a minute! Hi! Tate? How's it going? Oh. You're just gonna stand there? All right. Wow. This is a much different scene than the last time we were here. Why are you holding the trident? <laughs> What's with the spear? It's not a spear. It belongs to Poseidon, god of the sea. You know, a trident. Yeah? Why do you have that? We treat our customers like lords of the sea. We give them these tridents. It's like a little ranking system we do. Okay. The color changes depending on your rank. There's bronze, silver, gold, platinum, and at the very top, or a calcum. Right. So it basically measures how much money you've spent on these girls. Well, that doesn't sound very nice. It's more like a way to exploit their vanity. To separate our customers from their money as much as possible. Okay, I think that sounds worse. That sounds even worse. <laughs> okay, well... What's with that, I'm though? I'm still gold. Not that good. I mean, it's How the middle rank. How much to get that? Um, about 200,000 yen. Dang! I suddenly understand why someone would want to kill another human. <laughs> What? <laughs> okay. I'm a... Um, it's a good thing no, no one else can hear that. It. Is this related to what happened at Bloom Park? The body on the merry-go-round was Renju's ex-wife. I didn't know that she was Mizuki's mom. Did she change her name or something? Okay. Mizuki saw her own mother's dead body. Yes. And I just left her there and ran away like a coward. I'm such a piece of shit. I should have stayed. I should have done something. Why did I do that? Oh, I don't it know. You up inside, Ota? Yeah. Seriously. Oh. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> that was odd. While you're sitting here adding up your options? But you can order two, Date. That's not why I'm mad, Ota. Ota, you are a interesting person. Sure am. I come here whenever I've got time and money. I was here yesterday, too. Right. Around 6.30, I think. But I couldn't get in. I saw a sign at the entrance that said the whole place got rented out for some party. But I came all oh, the wait, way to Akihabara, you know? I didn't want to just go home, so I bought a new one. A new what? A phone? Okay, okay. I oh, dropped my old okay. one in the puddle, remember? So, I guess I've, I've lost track of the, the which, what day I'm on. So I guess it, this, it's the day after? the night we would have gone with Mizuki and seen the dead body, right? Because I'm worried about okay. Tessa. Okay, interesting. Iris, what's the matter? Yesterday night. Well, it was past midnight, so more like this morning. I don't care about the timing. What happened? Tessa was streaming as usual. Okay. From her living room at home, but suddenly, Actually, let me just show you. I always record right. the streams. Okay. 
So, uh, is this going to be something horrible? I'm kind of nervous. It's been a while. Hmm. Got it. I'll try my best. Okay, everyone. Here's my debut song. Let's hit it. Oh, I was <laughs> I was really I was really hoping I was really hoping that we would get the full song she gonna scream sorry everyone something came up but I've gotta go for now I'll sing the rest next time I mean you didn't start singing but yeah I, I get what you mean Okay. Right. When did they arrive? That's a One good question. One hour into the stream, so about 2 a.m.? That's weird, right? Okay. Someone a little bit, visit yeah. at 2 in the morning, and then she leaves? That is kind of suspicious. She looked really serious, too. I was worried about her, so I tried to call, but she didn't answer. She didn't read any of my Nile messages, either. I thought okay. maybe the people at Sunfish Pocket would know something. Tessie okay. used to work here. She made a lot of friends. I'm one of them. Convenient. I don't know what she's up to. I asked the other girls too, but no one knows anything. Okay. Iris. The number you are attempting to dial is either offline or unavailable. That sounds about right. No yeah, uh, let's hope that doesn't happen. Anyway, prophecies are simply not possible. Sure, they're not. Something wrong, sir? No, oh, it's fine. No, We're just thinking. Nothing. I wonder if Tessa's okay. I'm so worried about her, I can barely eat. Really? You look like you can eat just fine. Ota, uh, you know, sometimes... Sometimes you just wanna... You just make me wanna slap you across the face. Cause you're, you're kind of... Weird. It's probably a more extreme word to say for it, but... We can x-ray? Why? Why? Date, I must be the bearer of bad news. Even with x-ray, her clothes will not turn transparent. Your heart rate right. and blood pressure is rising. The concentration of phenylethylamine in your blood is rising rapidly. Okay. What are you excited about? Skeletons. Okay. Let's introduce way, ourselves after X-raying her. I'm Konami Dante of the Metropolitan Police Department. You're a detective? Something like that. Yeah. No. I mean, we already know this, up. but... When was the last time he came here? Hmm, let me think. He's just the owner, not the manager, so... He comes sometimes, but not all that often. Okay. Fair enough. That's what we call the customers. Us mermaids serve the Sea Kings. Right. And we really are mermaids, you know. Don't tell anyone. Sure. Uh, Everyone working here is a real mermaid. Sure. Legs. 
they were a gift from Poseidon. We were given legs and feet. So that we can gather riches and foreign currency in the labor market. Dante, let's <laughs> okay. go. <laughs> no, not yet. Okay. Still that got me. Learn. Do not listen to her siren song. Yeah. Let's, let's summarize. Date, Renju is not at this location. Yup. We have other areas I could have told you to that. Search. Yeah, you're right. Okay, well that was quite the interesting experience. Next time, we're going back to HQ, I guess. But for now, we're going to end the episode. So thank you all so much for watching. Bye-bye.